it's, it's a big production for us. It's the state's largest festival. The Cover Bridge Festival starts tomorrow, and that means vendors were hard at work today getting ready. Good afternoon to you. I'm Susan Dinkle. It's Thursday, October 10th. Park County, Indiana is home to nearly 40 covered bridges, and for 10 days each year, the community celebrates these unique landmarks. You can check out events in several Park County communities like Rockville. Rockville is Covered Bridge Festival headquarters. Mansfield is home to the popular Roller Mill, and Bridgeton boasts its operational cover bridge and mill, but it's Rockville. We take you to today. News 10's Heather Good has more on the vendors setting up and what you can expect there this year. Vendors are setting up on the square in Rockville for the covered bridge festival. This is just one of several locations you can visit over the next 10 days. The festival started here in Rockville back in 1957. Then it was just a weekend farmers market. Now Rockville is event headquarters and it's also home to the big tent. This is where many vendors choose to set up. Vendors here tell me they like this location because it offers better parking and it's easier for customers to get goods to their cars. There are also other small businesses to check out on the square. I spoke with a couple of vendors as they were getting ready for the festival. Some take the day while others need more time to set up. We set up about a week early. We, we put up the walls and then we put in the product and it takes us a solid week or more to, to actually set up. I spoke with vendors working this year's event. For many, this has become a family tradition. You'll hear more from them coming up tonight at 6. In Rockville, Heather Good, News 10. The Cover Bridge Festival kicks off tomorrow and continues through the 20th.